Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm visiting a farm called True to Earth Farm and I will include their website if you want to check them out. But they have vegetables here, they have strawberries, but I am standing in their flower field where you can pick your own flowers. I hope you enjoy this video. So these are status. Looks beautiful. It's a huge long row of status. Look at that. And then next to it they have some amaranthus or amaranth I should say. Look at this. And these are great for uh, including in your flower bouquets. Beautiful. So they do have names on the uh, beginning of each row. This one is called Coxcomb. Look at this beautiful red flower. I think this would make such a great uh, addition to a bouquet. Look at this. Gorgeous. Beautiful. Wow. So they also have some straw flowers over here. Both straw flowers and um, status make great dry flower arrangements. Beautiful. Look at this. Gorgeous. And of course they have some zinnias here. Beautiful colors. Look at this orange one. I don't have a, an orange zinnia. It's gorgeous color. Beautiful. So they have this long row of zinnias right here. Beautiful. And next to the zinnias are marigolds. This is just beautiful. I love walking through fields of flowers. Just gorgeous. Look at that. Beautiful. Here are some more flowers here. This one looks like more of a fillers for your flowers, just like these ones here. Cute little buttons. And then these are cone flowers over here. I'm sorry, these are echinacea. Beautiful, they grow so well here. I have never been able to grow echinacea where I am. I think they like it a little bit warm. I've tried, but they don't grow well where I live. These are beautiful. Look at all the bees. They're just enjoying these flowers. Look at that. Next to the echinacea row is some asters. Beautiful. Look at that. Gorgeous. So these ones are called globe amaranth. Look at this beautiful little flowers. Gorgeous. These makes great arrangements. You know, like a filler. Beautiful. And these are yarrows. And this one makes um, a great dry flower as well. You can dry these. So along with a status and a straw flower, you can make such a great bouquet when you don't have any fresh flowers around. 
I love this. Beautiful. So this is their uh, farm here. They have some vegetables. Um, they have melons. They have strawberries over on that side. And then you can see some melons over here. And over there, they have some corn. So you can walk around and look at all the veggies that they're growing and you can pick them. Pick Great farm. Here are some of the watermelons that they have right here. They got several of them. Look at that. <laughs> So they have some peppers, hot peppers and green peppers over here, the bell peppers right there. And some eggplants over here. And here are the strawberries. So you can pick your own strawberry over here. They look good. Look at that. Beautiful strawberries. So I wasn't planning on it, but I decided to go and pick some strawberries because they look so delicious. Look at these. And I believe they are organic. So you can pick your own strawberries here and vegetables. I decided to get some of these. I picked some flowers too. And so now I'm getting some strawberries. So I wanted to show you a little trick here because a long time ago when we first came to this country, we worked in the field, the strawberry fields, and I learned how to pick um, strawberries. So you don't want to be pulling the strawberry like this. And what you do when you pick strawberries, you put your thumb right here, the connector, and then you just go like that. And that's how it comes off. See that? See how easy that is? So you learned something today. Here, I'll show you one more time. Okay, here's another one. So you just put your thumb right here, and you go, whoop, and it just pops out like that. How easy that is. Okay? Okay, I think I picked enough strawberries. I was just going to pick a few, but we ended up picking all of these. Look at how beautiful that is. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.